the first video, lie on the back. If you are suffering from chronic neck pain, this lesson should be done with the utmost gentleness, slowness, attention. Put the legs together, lift both arms and interlace the fingers. Make round arms, by bending elbows, wrists, and of course, the fingers. Turn over the hands so that the palms of the hands face the ceiling. Try to lift arms toward the ceiling while keeping the round arc with the arms. That means to lift the shoulder blade without the head. Do it a few times within the comfortable range. The most important learning now is, to drop the effort, unnecessary effort, in other words, parasitic movement. Pay attention not to press the floor. Do not press anything into the floor. Allow this movement to be done so you feel the same effortlessness the entire time without any particular difficulty. Do slow movements. Try not to do any intentional breathing. If you need to do any intentional breathing, that implies that you are efforting. Try to drop the effort, leave the head hanging backward. Now, try to lift it toward the left and down a bit. That means toward the left side of the pelvis. Do the movement slowly so you do not need any intentional effortful breathing at all. Leave the head hanging backward. Now in the opposite direction, that means toward the right side of the pelvis. Leave it alone and rest. The second video, lie on the back. Put the legs together, lift both arms and, this time, without interlacing the fingers. Make round arms, by bending elbows, wrists, and of course, the fingers as before. Turn over the hands so that the palms of the hands face the ceiling. The tips of the fingers of both hands touch each other. In this position, lift the right arm toward the ceiling. The right arm while keeping the round arc. Lift it toward the ceiling, directly above you. Leave the left arm arc in the air without movement. Now, try to lift it toward the left side of the pelvis. Do it many times, soon you will notice. If you could leave the head hanging behind, the head turns as you lift the arm. It does not mean that you turn the head, but rather, the head turns by itself. Now, continue to do this and stand the right leg. Do this with the right leg standing. Feel the ease of turning the entire body to help lift the arm. Feel the ease of turning the head as a result of the upper chest being lifted. Leave it alone. Rest. Third video, lie on the back. Put the legs together. Lift both arms and, without interlacing the fingers, make round arms as before. Turn over the hands so that the palms of the hands face the ceiling. In this position, lift the left arm toward the ceiling, the left arm while keeping the round arc. Lift it toward the ceiling, directly above you. Leave the right arm arc in the air without movement. Now, try to lift it toward the right side of the pelvis. Leave the head hanging behind and let it turn. Do this with the left leg standing. Feel the ease of turning the entire body to help lift the arm. Leave it alone, rest. Fourth video, lie on the back. Put the legs together, lift both arms and, without interlacing the fingers, make round arms as before. Turn over the hands so that the palms of the hands face the ceiling. In this position, lift the right arm to the left, the right arm while keeping the round arc, the left arm while keeping the round arc. Continue to do this. At the same time, try to bend the knees and place the left elbow on the floor. Try to come up to sitting like this. Be sure that you do this with the head hanging behind. Do the same movement to the right side. Try once to the right and once to the left. Leave it alone. 